I want to talk about the music video for Zombie. If you haven't seen it, go and watch it. I'm going to spoil a lot of things and then come back. This video is directed by Greta Isaac and myself, the ultimate duo. Greta is my best friend. She's helped me with all the visuals across the last couple singles. She is incredible. We started by talking about concepts. We anchored it with a couple of key images. We knew at the beginning we wanted zombie boys. At first they were like laddie zombies, like bro zombies. And then we thought it would be funnier for them to be kind of like soft boy zombies, like Timothy Chalamet, black nail varnish, band t-shirt wearing soft boys. And although these zombie boys may appear sensitive, it was actually a super rare thing for them to express any emotion. And so that kind of anchored us. And then Gret immediately was like, this song has so much energy, there needs to be running. And so it was like, okay, I'm running, there are zombie boys let's just give me a reason to run. So we started to fill in the blanks. We decided that the zombie boys would cry, but it would be a super rare thing. So me as a self-appointed zombie rescue ranger would go and collect their tears in one of these. And then at the end, I would gather up the tears and shoot them all to save them from themselves. Shout out to Rufus on Instagram who lent me this water gun. This music video really makes me believe in the power of the internet. So we started to storyboard it out, fill in the blanks, gave the zombies like a reason to cry, a little character moment each. And then Gret made a storyboard where she basically drew out each frame. We decided whether it was a close-up shot or a mid or a wide. And then we put that in and timed those edits with the beat of the songs. We didn't have time to chop it up and make a video. So we made this incredibly bootleg video of me like moving through the storyboard with this song. <laughs> We did two shoot days in the town of Sheer in Guildford. Everyone was like, what are you shooting? I was like, Ugh. it's a really long story. The first shoot day was myself, Greta and Blake Temple who shot and edited this music video. Blake's style and energy was totally essential to this video working. He has an incredibly like fluid style of shooting. He uses a gimbal a lot. We gave him cinematic references and stylistic references like Wes Anderson and some more British stuff like Shaun of the Dead and Hot Fuzz and like he was able to translate that and be like crash zooms some beautiful cinematic wide symmetrical warm tone shots like Wes however Hot Fuzz crash zooms the first shoot day was a lot of me running running this way running that way from the front from behind we also had a lot of time on the first day to just explore different shots do some performance shots whenever we found a cool like backdrop like this one and uh, there's actually a shot where Gret shoots Blake in the background. So she operated the camera for a moment because we needed like a zombie kind of lurking in a silhouette. And we were like, there's only three of us. So Blake, get in the tunnel. Then we had shoot day number two with all the zombie boys. Apart from Martin, who's one of my best friends and I shared a studio with him. Everyone was a stranger at the beginning of the day. God bless Instagram, but they ended the day as a friend. Okay, yeah. Okay, cool. Everyone was so up for it, so in the spirit of the video, so up for putting crazy contact lenses in their eyes, and so up for me taking them to the top of a hill and shooting them. It was so cold, I felt so bad. We had all these towels ready to go, so I'd like shoot them, we would get it in slow motion, and then I'd be like, sorry. The second shoot day was busy, ambitious. I was nervous we weren't gonna get all the shots we needed before the sun went down, but even still we had time for just, making things up on the spot. And like that wide shot of me performing in amongst the zombies was something Blake suggested on the day. And I'm so glad that we got that because it's one of my favorite parts of the video. It was really hard to like muster up the energy to like give it socks while all the zombie boys were just like doing this. So Gret is like behind the camera, like also dancing so that I didn't like feel so alone. This is a map that Greta drew. This is me with my little hat. Um, and here's the rest of the town, and here are some of the zombie boys. This video was styled by Jade Hennessy, and we gave her a very specific brief. I wanted to be like a punky Girl Scout, self-appointed zombie rescue ranger, village weirdo, definitely like a role I've given myself, so it should look kind of homemade, kind of bootleg. My friend Aaron designed us this. Oh yeah, so sick. I love this. I'm going to try and get a couple on sale at some point if anyone wants to buy one. Jade made the bandolier, which is like the bullet sash. 
uh, the hat I borrowed from Dodie, the satchel I borrowed from Dodie, and then Jade found the rest. And as for the zombies, I mean, the zombies pretty much style themselves, and everyone came with, like, such great details. Nick, who's the busking zombie, like, brought a plectrum necklace. I was like, perfect. Band t-shirts, ripped jeans, hair tucked behind the ear. Yeah, and then ear tucked. We had a Zoom with the zombie boys ahead of time with Reb Day, who produced this video, and I gave them the brief and showed them a couple things for the styling. I was like, stripy t-shirts, dirty converse, does anyone have these things? And everyone was like, yeah, this is just my normal clothes, so I can pull something together. <laughs> All right, that's the zombie music video. Go and watch it if you haven't already. And thank you so much for the support on this song so far. It is one of my favorites that I've made in forever. So thank you for showing it love. Push it down.